This is the front. It has a circular driveway. Sorry, apologize for the night. Rocking, uh, rocking chair style porch. First, when you walk into the entrance way, you have the dining room to the right. Hardwood floors. And you have an office space bonus room to the left. That right there is a, a closet. Um, this also walks through to a hallway where you have your hall bathroom. And then this is the one of the bedrooms downstairs. They're using it currently as an office. Living room space here. And you have gas log fireplace. And I'll circle back around. Just like again, that's the front entrance way. Dining room to the right. Then you come around to the kitchen. Nice size pantry space as well. This is like a stone countertop. All appliances remain with the sale. And this is the breakfast area. Um, the lights on really quick, sorry about that. This is off of the kitchen area. Circle around back to the living room. Okay, and then you have the garage. Um, nice garage space. I don't know the exact measurements of it, but I think it's just pretty much standard. You fit two cars in here, and then you have that third space out there in the uh, in-law suite. But then right here is the laundry room. Washer and dryer remains. And then this is the master bedroom. Um, this is the master bath with a huge walk-in closet. Um, Standalone shower, tub, two vanities, tile flooring, hardware in your master. You got plan station shutters throughout. Okay, we'll go upstairs. Upstairs you can access from the you can go right or left to get to the bedrooms. Go to the left first. This is you got three bedrooms upstairs, carpeted, nice size. Jack and Jill style bathroom. This is very big. And this goes into the second bedroom upstairs because you got three all together. You can see Jack and Jill style. The third bedroom upstairs, you do have to walk through a bedroom to get to it, but it's a nice size. You can use it as a, it can be used for many things if you didn't need that fifth bedroom. Um, I'll quickly uh, show you the back. It is dark, <laughs> apologize. I had to squeeze in showings to get this video in. <laughs> um, let's see here, do I have some lighting? I do, here we go. Okay, this is the porch outside in the back. Um, you do have the in-ground pool. You can't see it now, but you have views of the pond. But this, you can see from my aerial pictures, the land. So, um, at least I'm giving you a, a little idea. And it's completely fenced in, in the back. You got the pool fenced in separately and then the fenced in backyard as well. And it's all done with the same wrought iron fence. And then this is the on, uh, in-law suite where you can use it as a pool house. You can make it into a workshop. 
there's a number of things you could do. It's got a full bathroom. And you can see it's a lot of large space here. It's completely um, central heat and air. Um, this is the full bathroom. You got a sink and you got a stand along shower. And then the single car garage. If I can find the lights, I apologize, you guys. Okay. And there you go. It is full right now, the owner's stuff, but you can kind of see it is a single car garage that is part of this in-law suite. So just a quick, quick video. So if you have any questions, let me know.